my mom had breast cancer when I was a senior in high school. I'll never forget how hard it was for her. And she became a survivor. She, she lived until almost 90. But it was a really tough time in her life. It was a tough thing in our family's you know, uh, progress and kind of journey through life. And uh, I never forgot that. So when I had the opportunity to really kind of look with a blank slate at what I did next, um, it was something that I really thought, you know, this is something that would be really meaningful uh, to women all over the world and uh, meaningful to my mom. What brought me to Delphinus is a technology that as I looked at the landscape of medical devices, I was looking for a company that had a truly transformational technology, something that could reset a space and address an unmet clinical need. And I looked at our SOFU technology uh, for early detection of breast cancer. Uh, and I think this is a transformative technology that can totally change the way we address early detection of breast cancer. When I look at Delphinus and I look at SoftView and what I think that this technology can do, um, I'm not sure I've ever seen uh, anything like this. I mean, this, this is truly transformational in an in a area that is, uh, to me, screaming for the next great technology. One of the things that jumps out immediately is the fact that uh, this is a warm water bath, no compression, no radiation. And when women hear that, uh, they rapidly raise their hands and say, uh, wow, I, I want to be screened using that kind of technology. So I think having availability of something like that is, is very, very additive. Um, you know, the, uh, the, the, the fact that you don't have to think about radiation exposure, you know, I mean, somebody could literally be screened on soft view every day and it would not, there, there, there would not be any issue of exposure. It's very in-depth, you know, you can see the, uh, the, the size of masses, uh, you see the stiffness of masses, so when we pass sound through tissue, and calculate the change in sound speed, different, different tissues respond differently to that. Uh, some tissues uh, shadow, create shadowing, some do not. And so we get great insight into that with this. But then you start looking at the next pieces of what builds a great company. And I think the first thing I turn to is the people. You know, do you have people that have great character and great talent and passion for what they do. Uh, you have to have great people and you have to have a great culture. And then you have to have alignment of all the people in the culture together to, to drive to your success. I think this is a novel and unique opportunity and I think uh, one that we can change the world with. And that's what I personally am driven by. I think that's what our employees are driven by. Um, almost everybody here has some connection to uh, breast cancer and, uh, and, and that, th that's way more important than anything else that might drive you to go to work every day and it makes you tenacious and it makes you not take no for an answer in solving something. You know, you can face a technical challenge and you say, I don't care, I'm going to power through it and do whatever it takes to get on the other side and I think that's the attitude we have here at Delphinus.